So if you haven't heard, you can actually play poker, watch YouTube together, play chess with your friends, and play a knockoff Among Us game and fish with your friends on Discord through the voice call. But Discord really hasn't implemented this yet. Fortunately, there is a bot you can use to force this to happen in any voice call. So you need to go to the first link in the description and you will see activities. Click invite this bot. Then all you need to do is add it to your server. I'm going to add it to the activity server and click authorize. Click I am a human and I made it through. Easy money. The bot will join your server and all you need to do is join a voice channel. Then I'm going to mute myself so I don't uh, annoy the heck out of myself. And to run the bot, all you need to do is do slash, then activity, where you can click on it. Then you need to pick the voice channel you're in, so I'm in the general channel. Then you need to click on your activity, so there's Poker Night, Betrayal.io, YouTube Together, Fishington.io, and Chess in the Park. I'm going to do YouTube Together because it's probably the most useful. Press enter. Then all you need to do is click to open YouTube Together in general. This will happen with every single game application. And now you have, you know, access to the game or app or whatever. All you need to do is click authorize. Then when you do that, it should load up, and now you can actually add videos to watch. So the way this works with friends is that A, they actually have to be online. If you notice on the right side, this is my friend account. They can't see that I'm doing anything, but if I go on to do not disturb, you'll notice that I now get this icon saying watching YouTube together, and all your friends need to do is just click on it, then click join activity, and now you both will be watching YouTube at the same time. And as you can see, if I click play here, it'll play over both of them. And there will be a very, very slight delay, but it's enough where if people talk over Discord, it's literally the same thing. You could always screen share, but once again, there is that gaming feature, which is kind of interesting. It's not my cup of tea, but it's there if you want it. Now, obviously, if you don't want this anymore, all you need to do is just leave the voice call. Then you just need to go to the activities bot and kick the activities bot. And once you do that, it'll be over and you don't have to worry about it anymore. That's activities bot. I love you. Mwah!